Welcome everyone back in the world of seven days to die to this evening. Okay, I thought it froze for a second. Well, the last time we were here, I built a bar during the blood moon and, well, honestly I wasn't able to do as much as I wanted. I wanted to do a little bit more to it, make it look even nicer. So, I thought I'd take the opportunity to come back and do it again the following week. It was a lot more fun than expected. So I picked up some supplies and made a couple of more things. We're going to drive out here to the little tree peninsula. If I think about it and get re get finished enough time, I'll jump off and swim over toward the end of the blood moon cycle. Because normally when the zombies start to respawn for me, it's in this general direction, between this rock and right here on the beach. You can see a couple of places in the water where I'll come out here to farm loot. I'll just sit on the top and shoot downward at them. We're going to head back out here to the dock and work on the Easy Horde bar a little bit more. I'd be so glad when they fully functional swim. It's not bad for what it is. I think it'd be awesome if they had underwater zombie types or possibly even zombie aquatic life. That would be amazing. One thing that I did do off camera in preparation for this, so I don't spend five, six minutes like a fool falling in and out of the water, I've added an easy ramp. Um, I never really gardened in this game, do I, do I punch it? I will mess with it later. Okay, I'm out here a little sooner than the last time because I, I want to definitely do some more. First thing I'm going to do, the lanterns are awesome, but they're a little bit bright. And it's very distracting, so I went with candles. Oh, no! Well, whatever. Are just a few minutes, well, a couple hours game time from where I was. Not sure what's going on with my capture. It's a good one, highly rated. Can't remember the name off the top of my head. It's not an Elgato, but keeps giving me problems like this, then I may end up just upgrading to an Elgato. It just suddenly stops recording. I went back to the beach there planning on doing a full reset because I didn't know how much of the original recording existed still and for the most part a lot of it was there so I didn't lose anything I'll just splice it together and tried to record another uh, Resident Evil video and yeah, about the first two thirds of it worked and then it just I don't know Oh well, we'll get it figured out. Anyway. Well, that was easy. Well, back here, I want to really dress up the bar, make it look awesome for the blood moon. That television's really kind of puny. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll get the bar looking really nice here. Like I said, I had a lot of fun doing this the first time, and wanted to just come back and finish the bar kind of in the scope. Of, um, what? It's the top block. Top block. Okay. Parkour up here. But wanted to come back and just kind of finish the bar and kind of the scope that I'd originally 
envision in my head when I was playing around with this idea. That'd make it look really nice. Good stair, uh, good ladder leading up there to our little balcony. Yeah, we'll call it a balcony. Why not? I might end up doing some more stuff like this on the Blood Moon. There's a couple of a couple other little ideas I had for what could be cheeky little exploits. I have a beer. Because at one point... That's the real one. Ooh! Because at one point I was digging a tunnel whenever I'd be waiting for the the merchant to open I'd be I'd just be there digging into the mountain across from Trader Joe's that's his name I'd just be digging into the mountain across from, uh, across from Trader Joe's and don't recall ever getting actually attacked there. Granted, I wasn't there on a horde night, but it still made me wonder if there's some sort of flaw in the in the uh, spawning AI for this dock area. Would the would the game be smart enough to spawn zombies to come get me in a mountain underground? So maybe later on we'll experiment with that. I'll probably first time I do it, I'll yeah, that'd be funny. I'll probably leave the tunnel just completely open, just full on YOLO it. See what happens. But then we then if it turns out to be interesting, we'll uh refine that idea, see if we can make it into something pretty funny. No. 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 Jump off the side and see what I can do. Huh. Another weird block. Oh well. We'll get up there and play with it. Ah, that's it. That particular block was doubled up. So this, this also was kind of a neat idea. Just something to pass the time during the the blood moon instead of you know focusing on oh my god I gotta get a a huge fortified base together or running in panic trying to survive because this game is very cathartic very relaxing with its building aspects so just unintentionally coming upon another opportunity to do that to utilize that particular feature during what is arguably the most stressful time while playing the game makes for a neat little discovery sorry I, my phone vibrated in IRL there and I lost my train of thought It probably wasn't very inspirational anyway. <laughs> and now, now the patrons have some room here that they can drink and not have to worry about tipping their head back too far and winding up in the water. I'm actually going to extend this side too. as well. 
I get on to the edge. I don't recall if I built wooden fence or not. I don't think I did. Can I build a wooden fence here? Yeah. I remember if this was something that you could do automatically or if it required a workbench. No, not ladder. Well, wouldn't that look goofy? Let's see what else we got. Uh, no. No. Eh, probably. Ooh, I mean. I mean, the trellis is objectively the nicest, but it just doesn't really make a lot of sense for for this particular purpose. This this looks more like something you... Alright, what's up? Your cereal? I don't understand. Does this not hug curves like that? No, okay, no, it wouldn't because each one of these, regardless of what we see, counts as a block on the axis. Okay. So, to make that work, in theory, if I rotate the block like that, put it there, it's craptacular. But, it's not a failure. Cause we can do that same thing again. Okay. Now that it's not perfect, but it's it. It tricks the eye well enough. Oh! What is that sound I'm hearing? It's not the crickets. I don't know. If, I don't know if what that was is actually in game. It's some sort of audio. Distortion, but I just keep hearing something that sounds like ah, ah, bah, ah. Come on. Probably gonna have to go in the drink again, aren't I? No. Hold on. I think I can get clever here. Okay, no, it's not a... That looks really awesome. Okay, no, it's not some sort of... audio distortion. It appears to actually be existing in the game. Ooh. Oh! Well, that's what I get for trying to make a good thumbnail. Oh well, I think I can probably find that exact second before I ruined it for us all. Okay, pick that up. This means I'll have to destroy this. Well, gonna be one of those days. This would probably be easier to place if I was using mouse and keyboard. I don't know, I know it's shameful as some PC purists go, but 
I've just never been able to bring myself to be fully committed to mouse and keyboard. The controller was what I started with. It's what I'll stick with for a while at least. Now I do like what we were going for here. I uh, made a part that I hope I hope this will fix that. Um, no, it's not going to. Uh, yeah, I'll do something about that later. Uh, let's see if I can repair this. No, I can't. All right. And I do like where we were going here with the easy horde signage. Unfortunately, oh no! Unfortunately, it doesn't read as as well because of the color scheme. Um. I don't know if I can fix this with wood, but I might be able to. Well, that. Hmm. Okay. Theoretically, I might be able to cheese this. If I find. No. Nope. Yeah, could that be it? Oh, there it is. Okay. Ah, uh, it's so ugly now. Alright. I'll look into seeing if I can replace those with something else later on. Uh, let's find a good good color here. There. I mean I like it, I just don't don't know how I feel about it being a solid color barnwood. What's that? Nah. Eh. Maybe, maybe. We'll, we'll, we'll keep Barnwood in mind. Or Redwood. Ooh! Ladies and gentlemen, we got a winner. That is beautiful. Beautiful color. Another weird sound there. Almost sounded like a. Almost sounded like an airplane flying over. Like not a seven days airplane, like a like a normal airplane. Although I heard it in the game audio, which is just terribly confusing. It's looking really nice. Very relaxing. Unfortunately, I don't really like the ladder looking. Okay, yeah, you know why this is kind of a pathetic fix, but it'll get rid of that. There we go. I like that. That's very nice. Oh, oh well. I can fix that pretty easily. Yeah, we'll put another one. Yeah, th this is really awesome. I'm, I had a lot of fun doing this for uh, for my viewer originally, and I want to come back and do it again. Finish up the actual scope of what I was hoping to accomplish out here. Although, I mean, if I'm honest with myself, I'm probably not going to finish it up this time either, but 
you know, at least, at least we'll put a really good effort into it. Wonder. Ooh. Um. It. I mean, it kind of works, but. I think I can get that same shape out of just a wooden block now. Yeah, and that, is that what that would be? Nah. That's probably some priming piece that I would need to need to drag a table saw out here to do. Uh, I don't want to bust it off either. That's all right. We'll go. We'll go back to the sign. We'll go back to the sign. Because, I mean, let's face it. This is probably not all going to be finished tonight either. Because we've only got four more hours left of the blood moon. And we've just been out here having fun. Well, it's been fun while while captures work properly. So far, it seems to be holding together now. I don't know. Might not have had the SD card in right, or yeah, there's any number of issues it could have been. Odds are it was operator error somewhere along the line. Ooh, that is very beautiful. I've always been fascinated with the look of the tree rings like that, the cookie they call it, the wood cookie, when it's cut that way. I always thought it would be very beautiful if the opportunity came along to make a, a wood cookie table. If you could get a large enough you get a large enough table, or excuse me, a large enough cookie that that you could sand it down, maybe stain it, maybe stain it. It just depends on what your taste is, but sand it down, get it, get it very, very nice, smoothed out, seal it. I think that would be. Oh yes, I think that'd be very beautiful. Um, what am I doing that one day? Just that kind of idea. I don't like that door, but yeah, whatever. Yeah, it looks nice. Yeah, we're getting some stuff going here, guys. I, I like this. Still not quite sold on our burn pit, but it looks awesome. What else can we, what else can we decorate here? Uh, desk, nightstand. I wish I had something that looked like a piano. That would be awesome. That's a few segments. Oh, I didn't think that was going to fit the, the way the coloration was there. I honestly thought that, that was going to, going to just refuse to cooperate. It's still kind of hard getting used to just how wonky some of these block physics are. I mean, like our wagon wheel here. I mean, that that makes no sense, but it looks pretty awesome. This will stand up. No, no. Uh, I'm 
I don't know how I feel about that one. We'll put you over here with the with the trash bag. It's looking less like a bar over there, more like a kegger. Let's see, is there anything nice we could do up here while we still got some some moonlight left? I don't know if I want to paint this to match our roof or... No, I don't. That kind, kindly ruined it. It looks really lame. Alright, that's better. Oh, don't fall. Come on. We only had one beer. I think. We'll have another one. actually kind of funny that loot respawned while I was gone. So I know how to make that. I don't want that. I don't want that. Reflex that. Huh? Be nice. It's just not the kind of shooting I normally do in this game. But yeah. I, I really like this. Return to the easy horde. The candles do look so much better. We're not our light's not oversaturated now, and this looks really nice. I want to put something here. What can I put here? And what, we're going to put the cold beer here. And... Mm, we're going to put a dark board. Right, fit right there. I don't know how I feel about it being over the spigot, but I don't know. We'll we'll, we'll leave it right there. See how it looks. Oh, no, we got here. Paint roller. I don't want to. Don't want to roll any paint. I may look into in the future bringing out some garage doors here. Definitely want to work on a little bit of beautification on the inside there, but. No, this is really, really awesome. I may wind up redoing some more of the dock here. But, yeah, here we go. Uh, we've spent another blood moon out, uh, riding the storm out, waiting for the fall out. And we haven't been attacked. So... I think we're going to call it quits here, and you know, maybe we'll come back here. This this is really nice. Uh, I and I've got a my base over there that you know, I work on, you know, mainly for functionality and you know just in case. But this is one of the few things that I've done just to be purely artistic in this game, and you know that's that, that's something pretty pretty special. I enjoy that that a game about shooting zombies and base building allows for this kind of kind of free play. I hope in uh, future updates they actually add more variety where you can do stuff like this. I, unfortunately I think that would probably change the tone and pacing of the game and might turn a lot of people off from it, but It'd still be fun to have it in there for people that want to do stuff like this, because, you know, not, not every night do you want to go out hunting the living dead. But, uh, I think I might just use this for my... That's going to be a screenshot here. But anyway, thank you for joining me here yet again. Uh, maybe we'll come back here or do another little project next Blood Moon. Thank you for watching.